All right, guys. Hello. Welcome to this card pointers sign up setup. So what I'm going to do here in this video is for the first time, I'm going to walk through card pointers. We're going to get to it. We're going to go to Chrome because that's what's suggested. That way we can also download the Chrome extension. So we're using Chrome and then downloading the Chrome extension. And we're going to walk through that login, sign in process. And then we're going to take a pause, a quick pause, and go over to the App Store. I'm going to download the iOS version app. And we will walk through that login to make sure that everything's connected and we can see how it functions. So for those of you who don't know, you can use the card pointers on your desktop. You can use this on Android, and you can also use this on iOS, which is wonderful. Makes it quick, simple, it's on your phone. Boom, it's in your hands, you can do your thing uh, whenever you go into stores. And just to recap what card pointers is, it's a way to earn more from your credit cards every day. So it, usually helps most people save $750 per year or more. Card pointers will help you use the right credit card to maximize your category bonuses on every purchase. You can also activate every Amex and Chase offer in just one click, so note that. And you can save money every time you shop with smart notifications online and in stores. So this is part of your points gathering journey and helps you to maximize those points. But in order to do that, you gotta get signed in, you gotta get logged in, you gotta do the download, you gotta have fun with this. So let's just hop right in. All right guys, so now you can see I went all the way down to the lower screen corner here, just to kind of whoop, 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 there, 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 there I am, there I am, there I am right there. So you can see me and know that you're not alone on this uh, simple journey. We're just gonna take care of this. So I already have cardpointers.com slash jgoot, which is what I'm gonna use to try and find it. So we're just gonna start right from scratch, as though I have no idea how to do this. We're gonna hop in, and it takes me right to it. So if you type in cardpointers.com slash, in my case, jgoot, J-G-O-O-T, that takes me right to it. Okay, we see, I'm just gonna tell you what I see. I see a special offer from Jgoot. You can sign up for Card Pointers Pro and receive a $100 savings card through Jgoot in three easy steps. So there's a sign up process. You can purchase the Pro if you wish, and you can download the app extension. So let's sign in here with an email and a password to get started. So you can type in anything you want here. At this point, you can type in your email address. I'm just playing around with it for fun, so I typed happytravels at gmail.com. Then click on the password section and choose a password. I would make two suggestions here. One, if you're comfortable saving it to your device, Feel free to do that, it's your choice, that's an option. If you're not comfortable, then I would suggest picking something very specific, not your birthday, keep it a little dysfunctional, meaning it shouldn't be easy to figure out and write it down. So write your email down, write your password, and set that aside. That feels old school, but really that is the most secure way, and card pointers is huge on security. That is the most secure way to make sure that no one gets your password to get to information. So again, your option is save it to your device or write it down or both, whichever one you choose. Just a suggestion. Okay, so now that you've chosen a, an email to use and you've chosen a password to sign in, now we're to a whole new page after you click the sign up button. Most card pointers pro users save 750 plus dollars per year. 
and now you can save $20 off the normal price and upgrade to Pro for only $99 lifetime plan. Best of all, thanks to Jaygoot, you'll also receive a $100 savings card when you purchase Card Pointers Pro through this link. So it's effectively free. After purchase, please allow two business days for your savings card to arrive by email from Jaygoot. So that's what I am seeing. Now I'm gonna click the Purchase Card Pointers Pro and move on to the next step. Welcome to the purchase page. So as you can see, it's $99.99. Originally it was $119.99, but with my discount from Jaygoot, uh, it's minus $20. So it's right back down to total due of $99.99. At this point, you should see your email. Uh, you can click a different payment method or you can pay with your card. So take the time, fill in your card information, month and year, your CVC code, uh, the name on the card, country, zip code. Click on Save My Info for secure one-click checkout. And then click Pay, and we'll move on to the next. Now that you've filled in all of your card information or chose a payment, now we're on the new screen where we need to download the extension. So now for the best part, earning more points and saving money with card pointers. There are great apps available for Android, iPhone, iPad, Apple Watch, and Mac. Plus an awesome web extension to help you keep track of all of your Amex and Chase offers and help you maximize your savings while you shop online. Use the buttons below to install the apps and extension for the devices you use. And be sure to log in with the same account that you created in step one. So I'm going to start here with Chrome. I'm gonna click it. Takes us to the extension area, which we see card pointers X, credit card rewards made easy. And all we want to do is click the Add to Chrome button and let it get added to Chrome. Add extension. Card Pointers X. Credit card rewards made easy has been added to Chrome. All right. So here's a suggestion. In the upper right-hand corner of your desktop, there should be a small little puzzle piece that is your extension. Click on that. I know you can't see it on my screen, but click on that. That shows your extensions. And then you should find Card Pointers X credit card rewards and pin that. Click the little pin and place that at the top so it's easy to find. Now that it's pinned, we can click on it. Let's see what it does. All right. Not logged in. Please log in to create an account. Okay, so let's click the login. So let's walk through what just happened. I clicked on the card pointers extension and it gave me the option at the bottom, which you saw, the download the app or the login. It also said that if the login did not work for some reason, to plug in the card pointers slash login that was at the bottom. So you could literally copy that card pointer slash login, paste it into your a new browser window, and when I click search, it brought me right here and automatically logged me in. So sorry I didn't walk right through that right away, but now you can see that if you, once you have started to set it up, you've downloaded the extension, when you, it's, you're asked to log in, if it doesn't work, use the card pointers slash login in a new browser window and it should bring you directly in here and sign you in all in one shot. So now that you're here, you have your account. You can walk through your account, you can walk through your password if you ever wish to change your password. Here's Card Pointers Pro, uh, Apple Wallet Passes, and an affiliate program. Uh, check out each one of these, walk through them slowly. So this is the sign up version. At this point, 
you can add cards and it'll start to show you offers. And remember, you still have the extension up here, which there are no cards set up yet, but at, at the point that you set up a card, more cards will show up here. And here we are looking for card pointers in the App Store. So we're gonna click on the App Store. Now that we're logged in on Chrome and we have the Chrome extension, let's go into search. You're gonna click the search. You're gonna type in card pointers, click search. And as you can see, here is card pointers. You wanna click on this. The icon will look the same as the icon that you saw on your web browser. We're going to click get at this point, wait for it to install, click open. So here, if you would have come across this app first, you would click on the referral code. If you had a referral code, you have an option to sign in with Apple. But since we already went through the process of signing up on our Chrome extension, we want to click other login options on the bottom left. And at this point, you want to add in your information, your email, and then also your password and then click the sign up login. Once you're logged in, you then have a save password option. If you choose, now that you're logged into the app, you can add cards at the top. Once you get to the dashboard, that gives you the chance to look around. You can see all your information. You can add cards. You can see offers and work through all the pointers. You can also do a search. So at this point, we work through the signup process, we work through the purchasing process, and we then went to our Chrome extension and, Chrome, and put in the extension for Chrome and made sure we were able to log in by going, in this case, directly to card pointers backslash login, which then allowed us to automatically log in and get us to this point where we are actually in our account and can start working on the account dashboard, the ability to sign out, where we're able to look at our account, we're able to change our password if we wish. We can click on Card Point is Pro, the Apple Wallet passes, and even check out the affiliate program. And at this point, we can start adding cards and start working on our points journey. So happy travels, and thank you so much for signing up for Card Pointers.